Love's Gonna Live Here by Buck Owens and the Buckaroos. We're taking you all the way out to Bakersfield, California for this one. Buck Owens and his band, the Buckaroos, are responsible for what became known as the Bakersfield Sound in country music. Now, this was a bit of a rebellion against what was happening in Nashville at this time, which was known as the Nashville Sound, which was associated with strings, ballads, a lot of production, and Buck Owens and his band were playing what they called hardcore honky-tonk music. Just a stripped down five-piece band and really happening dance rhythms. And they wanted to not follow suit with what was happening in Nashville, which was what they thought kind of soft. So they did their recordings in LA at Capitol Records and produced several number one hits, including this song, which actually spent 16 weeks at number one in the country chart, a feat that would not be repeated for 49 years following. This song was written by Buck Owens and recorded by him and his band, the Buckaroos, was originally released on Capitol Nashville in 1963. Love's Gonna Live Here is one of Buck's best known songs. It has become a country classic covered by many artists over the years and is just a recognizable, uh, joyful country song. It is a simple song using a 1-4-1-5 chord progression in the key of A. A note about the guitars on this song is that we are tuned flat. On many of these original recordings by Buck Owens and the Buckaroos, they tuned their instruments down a half step. So once we get into the context of this, um, you're going to be hearing A chords, but this is tuned down so it sounds like A flat. And this is to suit Buck's singing voice. He found his sweet spot and they tuned down accordingly. Only happiness, love's gonna live here again. Another very important part of this song is the masterful electric lead guitar work by Dangerous Don Rich. Don was Buck's right hand guy in the band playing all the lead guitar. Uh, bits of fiddle and also sang tenor on the live performances. He is not singing tenor on this track. A uh, little bit of trivia for you. You can, you can tell this is Buck singing tenor to himself. But Don was there on many of the classic uh, Buckaroos recordings singing the high part along with, with Buck Owens and their blend is one of the most uh, famous, well-known, signature duet blends in country music history. We're going to be learning all the specific guitar parts from this recording. There are two acoustic rhythm parts and the signature lead electric guitar that I mentioned, played by Don Rich. Uh, some really neat fills back up over the choruses of this song and then a really hot solo using a lot of great classic country telecaster tricks. We'll also go through an easy strum version of this song that any entry-level guitar player can jump right into. As we learn the parts of this song we'll be gaining some insight into the concept of layered acoustic guitars uh, playing out of different shapes. One of the uh, acoustic rhythm parts is in open position and the other one was capoed high up to get that chimey uh, sound and those two are playing slightly different rhythms that help complement one another. In the lead electric guitar part we're going to be learning some real specific signature Don Rich rhythm style lead guitar licks as well as a solo that really lays out a lot of his language which many of us through the years have imitated. Love's gonna live here again. So to get the most out of learning this song, you're gonna want an acoustic guitar, preferably with steel strings, but any type of guitar is fine. Uh, we'll be strumming using a pick. And then you're gonna want some type of electric guitar. We'll be playing a solid body electric guitar, Telecaster style here in that classic country style, the way Don Rich would have played it. But again, any type of electric guitar is just fine, and we'll be using the pick for that lead part as well. And as I mentioned, both guitars are gonna be tuned flat. Every string one half step flat from a standard tuning. 
So let's go ahead and tune up and get started. <laughs> 